What's up guys, it's Sunday night. It was a crazy day, um, crazy busy. Good eventful week. I had a great time with a lot of great fragrances. On Monday, I wore Invictus Aqua. Uh, very aquatic, beautiful scent. Love the way this one smells. It's like a bubblegum, fresh, sweet, um, just a very aquatic. Love the way this smells. It was a bit warm that day, so um, I really enjoyed wearing that one. Then on Tuesday, I have a little decant of Parfums de Marley Layton, and I decided to wear that. There was only a couple sprays in. Decided to just pull it out and wear the rest of it. It's such a pleasant, pleasant scent. I really want to pick up a bottle, but it's like $160 for a full presentation bottle. Um, maybe one day, uh, but a lot on the list that I want to pick up. I liked wearing it, so it was good. And it was actually a really cool day because I, I do real estate photography. So I was taking pictures of somebody's house and they found um, baby stray kitties on the side of the road and um, went into their garage. I saw two little eyes pop out, a little blanket that was underneath and they were put in a crate and they were well taken care of. They weren't being held hostage or anything. The owner just asked me if I wanted one and right then and there I said yes so I I have a cat now Mochi is her name and she's adorable I'll have to make a cameo for Mochi in the future the next day was an interpretation of Oud Wood from Dossier Fragrances um, very splendid scent I love just how professional this smells it's very clean just very overall satisfaction with that one and then the next day I got a package in from fragrance net um, I decided to pick up uh, Sauvage Parfum and um, I gave this one a full wearing on Thursday. I love the way this one smells. It's a soapy clean Sauvage. I do get what everybody's talking about with the performance with this one though. Um, the performance with this one, I, I lost it around five to six hours and I couldn't really smell it at all. So, which was a little disappointing. Um, it's a very good scent character. I have a bottle of ISO E Super and I did spray that on my neck a few times and then I sprayed this over it and it still didn't last that long. Um, I'm hoping I'm just going nose blind to it. It's a little bit of a disappointment, but I like the scent profile on this. Very clean, it's like a clean version of Sauvage. A great pickup, I, I think. Um, it's a little, I got my bottle for pretty cheap though, so um, I paid about like 68 bucks for it. Um, the next day, I guess I'm wearing Dior after Dior, uh, Dior 2020. Uh, love wearing the scent. This is just a massive, versatile scent. I love wearing this. It's um, it's just a great scent. Overall, just one of my favorites. Brings back so many good memories. Um, and then Saturday, uh, I was doing some moving for a friend and um, just, it was kind of a chill day, pretty much. I, I was doing some moving, but it was more of a chill day and it was kind of hot outside. So I went with Lacoste Loam Intense. Great cheapy scent, very citrusy, very just uplifting. Citrusy, cheap scent. And then today I was rocking all day Terre de Maze on Tense Vetiver. I did a uh, video that's coming out tomorrow about four seasons for uh, different colognes. And I included this one and it's a, it's a great scent. Lasted me all day. I refreshed throughout the day. I came back to the apartment and then went out. And um, so I was refreshing as I, uh, as the day went on. So very good scent, uh, very juicy, very just citrusy and woody like it. I like it a lot. But that was my week. Uh, let me know down in the comments, what did you wear this week? I want to hear what you guys are wearing. Every time you guys post something in the comments of like what you're wearing, looking up the fragrances, and sometimes you guys are wearing some freaking awesome shit out there, man. I'm jealous. If this is the first time watching me, I don't really record in a setting like this, but kind of just going with the flow here. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.